Hey guys, it's Carrie. I've got some interesting Indian wild cats and wild animals. Fishing cat live in wetland habitats and are good swimmers. Royal Bengal tiger, it is the national animal of India. Despite being one of the most densely populated countries in the world, India has not only managed to save tigers, but also successfully raised their numbers. Tigers are also found in Bangladesh, Nepal and Bhutan. Because these tigers are at the top of the food chain, they are very important for the ecosystem around them. This creates a trophic cascade where the top animal impacts all the other animals in the food web. When you remove tigers from an ecosystem, the rest of the plants and animals suffer as well. This would mean prey becomes overpopulated. As populations of prey, such as deer, increase, disease increases, and the plants, grasses, and shrubs are all eaten. Please subscribe, like, and turn on notifications. Asian Golden Cat is very similar to the North American Puma. Asiatic Lion Although male coalitions encompass multiple female groups, none of the female prides remain exclusive to any particular coalition. This works by the females being familiar with several males and this will help buffer and safeguard cubs against infanticide. This also helps to enhance genetic diversity of their progeny. Jungle cat are one of the most widespread and common wild cats in India. Asian buffalo, both sexes carry horns that are heavy at the base and widely spreading up to two meters along the outer edges. Notice the hooves are large and splayed. Marco, they are a unique species of mountain goat. They inhabit upper elevations with vegetation as their food source. They are skilled climbers and will scale steep rocky terrain to escape predators such as snow leopards and wolves. Asiatic ibex are wild goats. Both sexes have circular rings around their horns that represent annual growth. Both sexes also possess a large scent gland about three centimeters across beneath their tail. Red panda, they have a long shaggy tail and a waddling gait due to its shorter front legs. It's roughly the size of a domestic cat, though with a longer body. It's arboreal and feeds mainly on bamboo, but also eats eggs, birds and insects. It even sleeps up in the trees. Their long bushy tail with six alternating transverse ochre rings provides balance and excellent camouflage in a habitat with moss and lichen covered trees. The legs are black and short with thick fur on the soles of the paws. This fur serves as thermal insulation on snow covered or icy surfaces and conceals scent glands which are also present on the anus. Palace Cat has a greyish face, a stout build and long hair with white tips. Asian Elephant Males have an increased level of aggression during muscle and physically fight with each other to compete for mates. They use their tusks in combat and can become injured or even killed during these fights. Asian elephants have a temporal skin gland in their temples that is periodically active. During must, the temporal gland and the testes become extremely enlarged. There is a strong smelling secretion of the temporal gland which the mouse smears over his face using his trunk and levels of testosterone as well as other hormones are elevated. 
the female will only allow the strongest and most fit males to mate with her. The female's urine contains a sex pheromone that increases before ovulation. Bull sniff the female's rear end and urine and place the trunk tip into their mouth. Prior to copulation, they wrestle with intertwined trunks, bite each other's necks and the male attempts to mount. The male mounts the female from behind. Copulation lasts about 30 seconds. Newborn calves are very hairy compared to adults and much hairier than their African elephant calves. Please stay and watch another video with me. I love to read and reply to your comments. Thank you for watching my video. See you again soon. See you guys in my next video.